Boxing Opinions 100, hit that subscribe button. Don't forget it's free. Katie Taylor versus Amanda Serrano. Uh, these two ladies are the best of the best. The two best fighting the best. But what these two ladies left us with is a fight that will forever go down in the history of women's sports. But that fifth round, I don't think could ever, ever be topped by two women fighting on such a high level. If anybody was watching this fight, and when that fifth round came in, uh, you had to be on the, if you were a Katie Taylor fan, you might be have rooting for Katie to get out of that corner. And if you were a man, uh, an Amanda Serrano fan, you were rooting for Amanda to keep going. But I, I would like to know the punch output in that round, mainly from Amanda Serrano. But both fighters in general, I would, I'm, I'm going to have to go back because they both had to throw over 100 punches that round. As you know, Amanda Taylor averages 60 to 65 punches per round, and that's a, a very, very high level. But... You can't take anything from the champion, uh, Katie Taylor. Katie Taylor has done it a lot for women's boxing. And, and both of these women, this is a fight where there is no loser. I can't see uh, any woman being uh, put down. You know how you, uh, when, you, when you lose a fight, like say Amanda lost, so she would have to go back down, but... We all have to recognize that Amanda, uh, uh, Amanda Serrano, excuse me if I said um, Amanda Taylor, but Amanda Serrano came up two weight classes to face Katie Taylor. And just the fact of the power alone that this little fiery lady carries is very, very impressive because uh, Katie if you look at Amanda and Katie's shoulders, so Katie got uh, shoulders like a built like a, a man. Not uh, to say anything, that's a credit to her physical shape that she's in. But I, and, and if it wasn't for Katie's physical condition, I don't think she could have survived that fifth round. But this this fifth round was one. For the history books, I mean, and I, I go back and watch it, and it's just remarkable of two women putting out such a high level input in a boxing match. I, I thought I would never see this as a boxing fan, but it's true. So let me know what you think about the fifth round of Amanda Amanda Serrano versus Katie Taylor, and if I uh, said anybody's name wrong, I apologize. In the boxing opinion, and I'm out.